Hi friends! Today is Dapper Day, so we got a little dressed up, a little red number. It's supposed to be like a Captain Carter kind of bound-ish. I'll show you more what it looks like in just a second. This is my first ever Dapper Days of dressing up at the parks. I am so excited to see all the amazing outfits. We're also going to see if there's any holiday treats already out and about because the holidays don't start until Friday, which is in a few days, but they're supposed to have some stuff early, so we'll see. All right, let me see if I can get more of the look for you here. We got a little kind of American flag belt going on and then the Captain Carter hair-ish. I don't know. This Again, this is my first Dapper Day, so we're doing something a little last minute. But it's gonna be fun. We're gonna enjoy it. And I'm gonna show you all the amazing, amazing outfits that people are wearing today. So let's go. Okay, so finally scanned through the gate at like four o'clock, which is not great because the sun's already almost down, but that's okay, that's okay. We're gonna check out some holiday decorations and see all the Dapper Day outfits. I already see some amazing fits. Oh my God, they're like so good. I'm also very concerned that I will buy some holiday merch today because that's, I feel like that's just coming. And the castle completely has icicles on it. Also, I completely messed up one side of my hair. Like on this side, it's all twisted and I think that's how you're supposed to do it. And on this side, that's much. So you're getting best of both worlds on each side here. It's great. Look at the castle. She's so pretty. I feel like the decorations are even better this year. This is my favorite sweatshirt for the holidays. And look how perfectly it goes. What I'm wearing now. Yeah, that might be the one this season. But the gingerbread kind of looks angry. I do really like this one too though. Oh, it's so cute. Look at the little Mickey on the sleeve. I found them, I found them, I found them. These are the holiday bobble bar ears this year. Oh my goodness. They're so pretty. Like, the detail on them is just, oh my god. I found Tara! <laughs> Super amazing thing just happened. I had a wonderful follower named Ashley. Her username is Chipfield. She made a lightsaber churro holder. How cool is that? It's a lightsaber hilt and it holds churros. I mean, can you imagine anything more perfect for me? I honestly don't think so. So, thank you, Ashley! So something really embarrassing just happened. Um, I was trying to get, you know, some, some cute little footage of uh, Dapper Day outfits here in New Orleans Square because I saw some cute outfits. I was like, I followed these people and I was like, um, like uh, you, you look amazing. Can I please get a quick video of you? I, I always ask permission. And the guy turned to me and was like, um, you'd have to ask the boss man over there. And so I went to ask him and um, I, I did not know who he was. Uh, he was very kind and he let me take a quick little video of him. He was like spraying perfume. He's super cute. Um, yeah, it was uh, Dita Von Tisa's friend who was also standing right next to me in the perfume shop over in New Orleans Square and I had no idea. And um, this man apparently organizes Dapper Days and Dapper, Dapper Day events. Uh, and he's the guy that does that. And also Dita Von Tisa was there with him as her friend. Um, so don't mind me just asking for my asking for her stupid YouTube content with these amazing people that were just sitting there. So um, that's my embarrassing Disney story of the day. And um, Dita Von Tisa, if you're seeing this, you're amazing and I love you. And I'm so sorry that I did not um, say that when I saw you. Okay, thanks. <laughs> we're having dinner tonight at Cafe Orleans, which is probably, no, definitely my favorite restaurant in Disneyland. Um, some cast members made some magic happen for us and we got a table. So thank you so much to Maddie and Ashley. And I'm gonna show you the reason why it's my favorite restaurant in all of Disneyland. It would be due to this little meal right here. It's the three cheese Monte Cristo with palm frites. It comes with a side of jam for the Monte Cristo sandwich. And then we got the sauce for the fries. So good. You so though, I like that one better. You want to I like the sandwich in the jam. Mm -hmm. You like the one with the turkey? Yeah. Interesting. Okay. A lot of people do. Mm -hmm. And ham. I think there's two types of, yeah, there's two types. I think it's both. So it's a little dipped in there. So I have had this before. And I will say one of my favorite things are their palm frites. Smelling so good. So yeah, if you ever get a chance to get a reservation at Cafe Orleans, which they have a few open spots, um, usually like a couple weeks out, or if you can join the walk-up list at Cafe Orleans, 10 out of 10 recommend.